Yo, what is up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joe King Johnson 4 here, bringing you guys more Battlefield 4. And in this time, this gameplay, I went 20 kills and two deaths. Pretty incredible gameplay. I mean, overall, I think like 100% of the time, I went to rush. No camping. I rushed my ass out there. I took out them snipers. I took out one sniper at the end. It was just hilarious because the guy was freaking terrible at aiming. I mean, you guys are going to be able to laugh your ass off. It was just freaking hilarious. Uh, but in the beginning, you know, I actually spawned next to the enemies. And I was just taking them out like crazy right now. You should be able to see like a, like around a, a seven kill streak going on. And it's just pretty insane, guys. I mean, I just know how to react and everything. I just brought everything from Call of Duty over to Battlefield 4. And it's working for me a lot better than Call of Duty Ghost. And, um... You know, overall is going pretty well because of this weapon that I'm currently using, which is called a Type 95B. And uh, this Type 95, I have, have it set up, this just makes it look like the king of short range battles to medium range battles. There's no way you're gonna be able to miss. It's just that accurate. So, um, and from hip firing, it's pretty good though. It's pretty good. It's not as good as the SG553, but it's, it's there though. It's like right under it. And uh, trust me, this gun is just perfect for those kinds of situations. If you're playing Operation Locker, use the Type 95. If you're playing in this map, use the Type 95 because there's mostly medium range battles. But this gun has like pinpoint accuracy at the beginning of the when you shoot down, and uh, you know you should be able to take out the enemy pretty quick. So um, it does reach us pretty far. Like talking about gameplay wise, like how much I, I play with the Type 95, it does reach pretty far, no matter how much the stats say, it's like, oh, it's reach is pretty short or whatever. No, it does reach pretty far. I've been taking out people from across the map, maybe sometimes, not not from a big ass map, like I'm talking about like small maps, and uh, maybe like, uh, you know, like from here to 100 yards, maybe. <laughs> yeah, from that long. Actually, I've taken out one person like that, and uh, it is pretty goddamn accurate. So I'll say, like, imagine like around 80 yards to 70 yards. That's how much this gun can shoot from. Pretty crazy stuff. And even though it does say like it doesn't have any range, it does reach that far. So believe me, trust me when I say this. Use the Time 95 if you want to own everyone in squads, TDM, domination. And in um, that bomb game, I forgot which is called Obliteration. I really do not know what's the name because I haven't played it yet. But you can use it in that one if, if it's uh, you know small stages. But anyways, 100% sure, guys. I'm 100% sure this gun will raise up your KD. For those hardcore fans of Battlefield 4, if you're looking for some hardcore shit, the Type 95 is gonna get you there. If you want that freaking rush technique, you know that that kind of feeling of sneaking around, the Type 95 will be there for you. And the way it's going to be there for you is because I'm going to set up a best class setup for the Type 95 next week. Or I'll announce it like pretty soon like in one of my gameplays this week. Because I do have tons of gameplays with the Type 95 and with the CQBC. I forgot the name of that other gun. But, uh, you know, I have tons of gameplays. I will be announcing when they will come because this is mostly going to help you out. Raise your KD, help your teammates, you know, uh, dominate out there like like nothing you're gonna be the king of everyone i mean right now the people that i'm playing with in my squad i mean they all sent me friend requests they all did i mean i think i'll show you guys like the, that gameplay like later on to this week and i think i'll show you like around wednesday or thursday depending on how it is uh how i set up my schedule so um so yeah i mean everybody just added me because you know i was just owning back-to-back -back gameplays i mean like seriously i think like around like around seven gameplays i went like around 20 plus kills 20 25 the highest I ever gotten was like around 29 and like maybe like the highest amount of deaths I've ever gotten for the past seven games will be seven deaths seven but 100 percent of the time I will be over 20 kills that's a lot <laughs> it reminds me a lot of my modern warfare three days because that's how much I will always get you know one out of three one out of three I'll, I'll die you know and uh, yes, my KD, um, I think I haven't checked yet, but I think it has risen up because since the, I know the first week I did check it and um, it was like a 1.68 because I was getting used to the game. I was learning the maps. I was learning the weapons. And uh, now that I'm better, uh, you know, this past one and a half weeks, um, I think my KD has risen up because of the time 95 a lot today. And this was recorded on 127-2014. Yeah. So, um, 
and this is where all those gameplays happen. You should be able to see all the gameplays that I played today throughout the whole week. It's gonna be freaking insane. So if you guys want to see more gameplays, more Battlefield 4, you know, techniques, explanations, or uh, kind of strategies that I will be explaining to in the video, you know, just subscribe for more, guys, because it's gonna get insane. It's gonna be getting very crazy around here because nobody, for sure, has ever done this in Battlefield 4. Go that insane. Take out people back to back. Survive some certain shots. I mean, it's just crazy, guys, how I end up surviving some of the certain shots that you will see in this gameplay. I mean. And for sure, guys, and uh, you know, you have your eyes glued in the gameplay. It is insane. I'm telling you, it is in freaking insane. Um, no, I'm not looking for a clan, though. I'm just playing for you know, just for fun. So, uh, for those of you clannies, you know, in Battlefield 4, no, I will not accept any kind of clan invites. Um, that's another thing. I will not accept any clan invites because of the, the way you know, it's just. I don't know. I need to find out how this works, anyways, but with the clans. Um, but yeah, overall, you know, the Type 95 guys, you know, it's always going to be there for you. And also, it's the second to the last gun to unlock. So you're going to have to do a lot of work, guys. It's, it's going to take you like around five days, depending on how long do you play. Because I know I'll play this game like around maybe like three hours, two hours and a half per day. And that's how long it took me to unlock it because I played Conquest. I said just to play Conquest first. And you should be able to unlock several guns, several attachments for several carbine rifles, and you should be able to, uh, you know, level up at the same time. So you're gonna be able to unlock a lot of weapons at the same time. So play conquest, play rush. Those are the easiest ones to level up in, and you should be able to unlock these weapons as quick as possible, just by playing those two game modes. So, um, so yeah, guys, you know, I just give you an extra tip right there. You know how to level up as quick as possible. Just play those two game modes. Pretty insane stuff. I did show some of those gameplays, you know, earlier um, this month, and uh, hopefully you guys go back and watch them because they're pretty interesting. You know, that's how I started off. You know, I started off with a with a little bit of a eh attitude. You know, like uh, I, I really didn't know what to do. Now I know what to do. It just took me like a like two weeks and a half to know, you know, every single map, to know every single weapon, how they react, which is the best for which. You know. God damn, I'm already used to it, guys. <laughs> it took me that long to get used to this game, and I'm doing a hell of a job. So, um, so yeah, guys, you guys are waiting for me to take out a guide on this, you know, for those if my brother decides to put this video on his channel. Um, the guide will probably be coming out, like, next month. I am preparing to do a guide on this, on this game because it's pretty much insane how I'm playing right now and it's pretty good and hopefully and i want to i want you guys to do the same thing you know i want you guys to own so um for those of you in gamers nation 360 a guy will be coming out pretty soon so uh this is all for now guys leave a like leave a comment tell me what's up and tell me what's your favorite part of this gameplay because god damn it it was freaking crazy insane and i've never survived that long not even Call of Duty, the longest I survived was 80 and 0, but the second time was like a 98 and 8 or something like that. I never gotten that low. So it's pretty much an insane gameplay, guys. Insane. So just leave a like, leave a comment, and tell me your favorite part of the video. So I'll see you guys later, and enjoy your day.